Hello, everyone, and welcome to Mystic Door Tarot. This is Barb with your daily tarot card reading for Saturday, August 24th, 2024. And today we have Major Arcana card, Death. Well, certainly, this could be depicting the end of a cycle. It's indicating that something has come to its natural end and a parting of the ways is now in order. There's an indication here that when something is taken away, something of equal value has to replace it. And certainly we should adjust our thinking to account for this aspect. You know, the death card gets a bad rap, mostly because of the pictures the artists put on the tarot cards, but it is a clearing away of negative conditions to make way for more positive ones. Very much a liberating energy as there is a natural tendency to cling to what has been known simply out of fear of the future. So this is rebirth. Now the skull and the skeleton imagery comes into our quest as a sign that this process does not have to be a physical death. So it simply could be an indication that something has run its course. Maybe a natural cycle has come to an end. This is an energy coming in of releasing and clearing and the disintegration of the old to make space for the new. For some of you, it can be an energy coming in like an act of clearing, like quitting a job or decluttering a closet. More often, though, it asks us to surrender to the natural process of change, allowing what has ended to fall away. So with the death card showing up today, what are you ready to release? Even though an ending may be sad or difficult, you may not know what will follow. So you need to trust that your inner wisdom will guide you through this transformation. So for some of you, this is closing one chapter to begin another marking an end of a phase. It could be the final wrap-up of, of a situation, clearing the way forward. But for some of you, releasing what's no longer needed in your life to make room for new growth, clearing out the old to make way for new opportunities, and learning to accept and adapt to major life changes. Because this is a major kind of card. Transformation is the name of the game especially with the death card coming on the scene, going through big changes that can reshape your life. But this is starting fresh with a sense of renewal and possibility. So the start of something new after what would be considered a significant ending. This is Scorpio's card in energy, a major arcana card, with the numerology of number four. So if you are a Scorpio, this is your card, your energy coming in today. You might feel it more than others. Or possibly, you have some of the traits of the fixed water sign Scorpio, which enriches situations with intensity, mystery, it's diving into emotions, rebirth, uncovering hidden truths. That certainly could be happening for some of you today, as Scorpio encourages exploring the depths of your psyche, embracing this transformation, and letting go of what no longer serves you. This being a major arcana card, which carries its own unique energy and symbolism, it can be a profound life event happening, the closing of one door to open up another. It is simply explore the bigger picture of life's mysteries. And the number four numerology is grounded in its essence, resonating with a stability structure, urging you to lay strong foundations and steadily work towards your goals. This water element encourages us to listen to the whispers of our intuition, guiding us through life, just as a river finds its course. Now, the crystals that are specifically associated with the death card are bloodstone, obsidian, Apache tear, black tourmaline, amber, zebra stone. All have amazing properties that can help with completion, transformation, change, and letting go. As that is the name of the game today, letting go of something that has run its course, whether it be in regards to the job that you do, 
the company that you work for, possibly where you're living, and certainly can be in regards to relationships that have run their course. No longer the same feelings exist as there's been a constant evolution and transformation within the relationship. So today, the death card is showing up not as physical death, but the ending of something that needs to go in order to provide the space, the room for the energy of something new and positive to take its place. Well, that is the energy for today. Thank you so much for joining me. Love and abundance. Until tomorrow.